Hey Natural Beauties, it's Curly Kimmy Star, and I am here in the bright LA sunshine. It's a little bit chilly for us, which those of you in colder climates know that this is not chilly. Um, but it's like 55, so it's a little chilly for the LA weather, but sun always shines out here year round, so it's nice. Um, it's been a bit, it's been a minute since I've done a video, but I'm just gonna go ahead and get started. Holidays and soccer tournaments and whatever. So the, I'm actually going to do a couple of videos today. So I will be wearing the same outfit for like four videos because I am not changing. It's not that serious. Um, so the first product review I'm doing is actually a product called uh, from a company called Sincerely Natural Apothecary. And this is their shampoo bar. It's their original shampoo bar. And I'm going to show you, and this really doesn't, in fact, I'm going to show you pictures of it <laughs> that I took when it was nice when I first got it. Um, it was given to me by Makeup and Beauty Junkie. Thanks, girl. And um, so this is my review of it. It looks really kind of yucky, but this is, it's dry, but it's been in the shower and gotten all wet and I've used it. So I will show you the nice version when I got it, what it looked like. But, so let's just go ahead and get started. It actually smells just like soap. It's just like a regular soap smell. Um, nothing fancy, nothing sweet, you know, it's just like, smells just like soap. Um, and the ingredients are, let me get those and read a couple of them for you. Um, it is their original shampoo bar. <clears throat> and a few of the ingredients are cocoa vinegar, sal butter, more mora butter and avocado oil and i'm just going to leave the rest in the comment section below because you know i cannot pronounce anything it always just sounds crazy the so those are my ingredients a bar so i'm not really gonna be able to show you the consistency but it um it set it up a little bit before i put it in my hair so i you know as you use any bar shampoo or um soap you just suds it up with water in your in your hands and then put it on your body hair or whatever um i did not use this as a body bar even though it's actually a really good as i was reading the ingredients online today i was like hmm i might have tried it as a body bar and i actually will now that i um thought about it but um basically the way you use it just like you'd use any shampoo bar get your hands wet put it in your hair massage it in your temples etc and um get it all through your hair and i use this bar about four times and basically my opinion about the bar is this my hair felt a little bit dry after using it uh, not a ton dry not super dry not dangerously dry but after i rinsed my hair out um the shampoo bars that i'm used to using left my hair totally soft super soft in fact and this bar actually did not my hair was just a little bit dry um, but super super clean so the way i'm going to use this bar and i am going to use the rest of it is as a clarifying treatment because afterward I wanted to use and actually I did use when I used it I, di I did it with the days that I was doing a deep conditioning treatment just to make sure that I got my hair back to feeling nice and moisturized again um, but it's not something definitely couldn't detangle with it um, which I don't really me personally I know that some people do I don't detangle with my whether it's a shampoo or shampoo bar that's not something I do any detangling with um, or run my fingers to at that point in, in my um, hair cleaning process um, but so I don't even know why I said that because it doesn't really matter because I do not I would never detangle with it But because my hair felt just a little bit dry I Definitely would not even try to manipulate my hair at all with it um, It may work for somebody. I mean again my hair if you are first time watching my videos you, you don't know anything about me or my hair my hair is low porosity I do have thick hair, but the individual strands are fine and medium so I, you know, I don't know. It could just be my hair, and maybe it's one of the ingredients. But it did leave my hair a little bit dry. But again, I'm gonna finish using it. So it was not nothing major. My hair felt super, super clean. So for me, I'm gonna use it as a clarifying treatment, um, a clarifying shampoo. Generally, the clarifying shampoos that I use do leave my hair feel a, a bit dry, which is fine because at that point, I want my hair to be super, super clean. Any resi any residual buildup of the butters, oils, or whatever that I use, I want to make sure they get out of there. So that bar to me is going to be a good clarifying bar. So I guess that's all I have to say about it. I'm just trying to think. Smell, consistency. Oh, the bar, it cost, I think it's $13.50. Let me just confirm that. Yeah, the bars cost $13.50. And I will leave the website below where you can purchase it. And 
I guess that's all I have to say about it. If you have any questions about it, definitely let me know, and I will catch up with you guys on the next video. Bye.